What's up guys, my name is Hans Wouters and I want to start this video with a quick announcement and that's the fact that I'll be going to the Soik and Longboard Dance event upcoming Saturday in Eindhoven, the Netherlands. So I hope to see some of you guys there and if you do see me, feel free to say hi, uh, I won't bite. <laughs> and actually in the spirit of the upcoming event in Eindhoven, I checked out my old notebook in which I have all my secrets and actually there's also this page Eindhoven 26. 16, in which I actually planned out my uh, competition run. That year I took it very serious. Uh, it was the first year I was sponsored by Caliber Blood Orange. So I felt like I had to prove myself and I really trained, so to speak, for it. That's the only year or the only time I actually uh, took it this serious for longboarding. And it actually went well. I was in the finals, I think I was like probably fifth or something, but still that was great. I took third place in best trick. And so today I want to check if I'm still as good as I was. So this is six years ago. So I want to see if I can still do these things and how it goes. So today I'll be trying these. And yeah, for each trick or line that I can't do anymore, I will buy someone a beer next Saturday at Soika Longmore Dance. <laughs> so yeah, let's grab my stuff and I'll see you guys there. Second line is a pirouette step. I had to think what I meant with this because I don't call it like this anymore, but I think I know what I meant. So let's give it a shot.
challenge, nice to do it again. Maybe I'll include it in my lines again. Next up, there's this sort of cross stuff, a pirouette combination, so let's go. this one and it looks maybe a bit strange <laughs> so yeah success but feels a bit strange uh, next one shouldn't feel strange because it's one of my favorite dance lines which is the twist step as I called it let's go for this one this one should be fun Although I thought this one would be easy because I've been doing this, turns out I was doing it very differently back then. That takes completely different positioning of your feet and balance during the spin. So it was not as easy as I thought. So I just unlocked, I re-unlocked this dancing combo. So that's nice. Stay moist everyone. Next up is another dance step, which is what I call the swift step. Let's go. So that was five lines already, I got one left. And what I found very remarkable as I'm trying these, maybe you noticed it too, is that it's very dance centered. So most of these were just dance lines. So yeah, I find it very different. Me six years ago was doing way more dancing than even me now. Last one is a freestyle combo. So here I want to do just tricks, which was either a big spin or a fake knock by big spin. Secondly, a knock by shove it, knock by into pivot, or a knock by finger flip. And then thirdly, 
a kick flip, a tiger claw or an occupy finger flip. So I'll do the hardest combination of these three which would be in my opinion fake a big spin, occupy into pivot and then a kick flip. And yeah if I can do this then I've proven that I'm not, <laughs> not as bad as I think I am. <laughs> So that's it for today's video. <laughs> I think in conclusion, um, I can still do the things that I used to do. Maybe not as consistent. But yeah, on the one hand, I used to skate like every other day. And on the other hand, these were the things that I was actually doing back then. Now I do completely different stuff perhaps. So doing something kind of new again always feels weird. But yeah, it was good fun trying these things. It inspired me to try some new dancing lines as well. Or to incorporate some more dancing inside my tricks and um, yeah I think in general the moral of today's story is don't stress about your skills or the fact that you used to be better or you want to be better whatever situation that you're in don't worry about it it's very tempting to just keep thinking in your head about these things but just try to keep it chill try to just enjoy what you're doing right now today uh, have fun on your board, whatever level you're on, whatever you used to be or you want to be. Um, just enjoy it and just have a good time. That's what I'm trying to do. So yeah, Leslie, once again, hope to see you this Saturday. If you can't come, uh, no worries. I mean, maybe you can come one day or to another contest closer by. Maybe that's even more fun for you. Hope you just have a good day. Hope you have a good week. Maybe go out and skate if the weather is nice. And anyways, big hugs from Belgium. I'll see you guys in the next one. Ciao.